Hi everyone. In this video we are going to learn about two topics quarterly returns and annual returns which comes under regulation number 4 and 5 of MMR 1961. While learning about this topic we should be clear on four things. First one is by whom the return has to be submitted. The second point is in which form the return has to be submitted third point is when the return has to be submitted fourth point is to whom the return has to be submitted because in dgms computer examination most of the time the question comes to whom the return has to be submitted so you should be very clear in these four things first let us see about quarterly returns the quarterly returns are submitted by owner agent or manager of the mines it has to be submitted in form 2 and it has to be submitted on or before the 20th day of january april july and october in every year in order to remember this we can remember it shortly as j a j o and the quarterly returns has to be submitted to chief inspector and regional inspector now let us learn about annual returns annual return has to be submitted in three cases case 1 is regular annual submission of annual returns second case is when the mines is abandoned or when there is change in ownership case number 3 is when the mines is discontinued for a period of exceeding 60 days in case 1 regular submission of annual reports the annual returns are submitted by owner agent or manager of the mines and it has to be submitted in form 3 of first schedule the returns has to be submitted on or before the 20th day of february in every year and the annual returns has to be submitted to district magistrate and to the chief inspector in case 2 when the mine is abandoned or when there is change in ownership in this case the annual returns has to be submitted but there is no change in to who has to give that is owner agent or manager has to only give and there is no change in the form that is form 3 it has to be only given and it has to be given to only district magistrate and chief inspector there is no change in this the only change is it has to be submitted within 30 days of such abandonment or change in ownership case 3 when the mines working is discontinued for a period exceeding 60 days the annual returns has to be submitted same like case 2 there is no change in by whom it has to be given in which form it has to be given and to whom it has to be given the only change is it has to be given within 90 days of such discontinuous